So where are we going then, Mark? We're going to Brighton. Why are we going to Brighton? Going to look at a boat. <laughs> Another one? Yeah. What's this one? This one is a Cadillac 10M. And what's a Cadillac 10M? It is a 33 feet catamaran. But it's kind of like a Rosie Royce type catamaran in that it's big and spacious and very wide. And will it fit two adults, teenage daughter and two German Shepherd dogs? Yeah, just about, I think. <laughs> Do you think we'll fit better in that one than a Morris Griffiths Gulfstream 45, which I really liked? Hmm. Um, that's an interesting question to which I don't know the answer. Will Leah like it more than the Gulfstream 45? Leah will love it more than the Gulfstream 45 because she hates the Gulfstream 45 because <laughs> the small room is small. Okay, and it didn't have a real shower, did it? No. No, this is teenage first world problems. When choosing anything, it has to have a real shower um, and lots and lots of space. So we told her that actually, because of our budget, space might be an issue. Isn't that right? Yes but she wasn't happy. <laughs> no, no. Because um, it looks like Leah will probably stay with us for quite ever. a few years yet. <laughs> Pretty much ever. Yeah, we don't think she's ever moving out, which means that we have to now find a boat that's going to be big enough to not feel claustrophobic for her. Hence our very long drive on a Friday afternoon um, around the M25. Um, oh no, we're not on the M25 now, are we? We were. We were on the M25. That We passed that one quite nicely because uh, all the solid traffic was going in the opposite direction. So now we've got a long journey down to Brighton on a really overcast day to go and look at a Cadillac 10M. Yep. 10M. So because we haven't got Leah with us, we've got to take lots of photos and videos. So, yes, yeah, so we'll update, well, we'll get some more video for you and lots of photos because Leah's not with us and she wants to be able to see it. And uh, our time is running out. We've got a couple of weeks left. Yeah, the house is sold. The, yep, the house is sold. Whee! <laughs> um, we've had confirmation um, from the buyer that their mortgage is going through without any troubles. We're now just waiting for completion date. So we could be looking at uh, ooh, two to three weeks. Quite possibly, yeah. So it's like panic and run, panic and run with regards to packing. We haven't found our boat yet. We haven't secured our residential moorings either because we haven't found the boat yet. And one of our local marinas will only take boats that are 40 foot long and over. Yeah. Um, but we have had quotes from another marina. so. There are options available, aren't there? There are. So, yeah, so we'll be back in, in a little while with some photos and videos of the Cadillac 10M. I know we bored you with um, a video full of photos in our previous video that Mark did for us, but we thought we'd put a couple more in today just to show you around the boat again. We really liked the spaciousness of the boat, the amount of storage there was. Mark particularly liked the fact that he didn't have to duck at all in any of the cabins or in the salon saloon. And we're quite looking forward to going back again next week with Leah to show her around the boat. She's very excited about this one. Oh look, and there you can see the boat and that person that's climbing down, that's Tim from Boat Shed. Um, he's just recorded another video to go up on the listing page. So that's quite good fun, quite exciting. So yeah, big thumbs up to Tim. He was really good, really helpful.